This invention changed warfare and it wasn't even a weapon. In medieval Europe, if you break your weapon, you were done. Every sword, every musket, every piece of armor, handcrafted by skilled artisans. Parts were unique, fitted by eye and totally unreplaceable on the battlefield. But 10th century China, different story. Their armies carry crossbows with interchangeable parts. Yes, interchangeable like Legos. If the spring broke, you replaced it. The limb cracked, you swapped it. And that's the twist. Logistics, not brute force, won wars. A soldier didn't need a blacksmith or a workshop. The military just needed to stock spares. That meant fastest repairs, long campaigns, and more resilient armies. The West wouldn't catch up until 500 years later. In Europe, every part still had to be hand fitted. It wasn't until the 1700s that the idea of identical parts became a spread in France, and most of Europe still ignored it. So, where did mass production begin? Not in Detroit, not in Britain. It started in ancient battlefields where China turned weapons into systems and changed the world without anyone noticing. The secret weapon of ancient world was standardization. 